Hey everybody, it's Chris Demetric here from TDW and I actually purchased myself a new couch. Um, I've been looking for something to watch TV and take naps in and a traditional couch is always what I've had but you know I rarely lay in that um, so I thought you know this would make the perfect sense. This is a uh, sort of a side-by-side. -side. It's got a little area here for your remotes and whatnot and uh, it's nice because it reclines on both sides if I want to chill out a little bit here, watch some TV. But there's one issue with it, and the issue with it has to do with this little center console. So I'm a person who enjoys my snacks, obviously. I mean, I could toss some stuff in there, but I use mason jars generally to drink and eat in, and oh, they don't really fit in this. They don't even sit in there nicely. I mean, I can't even stand them upright. And, of course, I'm not going to do that with a glass of water. cup is only like an inch and a half deep. Anyways, I think what we should do is make some type of tray um, that sits on the top of this. But anyways, let me go ahead and uh, come up with a design that might fit um, over this, like retrofit right over this existing... Uh, this existing little ledge here that's pretty much useless. So, all right, let's come up with a good design. So I did my measurements. It seems to be about 12 inches wide. I was going to go all the way to the ground, but uh, I think I'm going to cut it down to about half of that. So instead of just simply making an L and setting it on there, um, I'm going to hinge it right here so this car part can come up. So I was thinking of the best way to mount this, um, whether it's just going to hang there and swing out. Um, but I actually want to have an area that I can hang my headphones. I use headphones when I listen to TV at night. And then maybe a place to put a remote. So I want to mount this somehow to the sofa without screwing it into it. And I thought to myself, you know, I bought this for another project. Some really heavy duty uh, hook and loop um, material. This. Velcro brand is really good. It should put the weight on there. So I just think I'm going to basically attach it to the back and then I'll attach it right to the thing. I think this will work perfectly to hold it in place so it doesn't slip off. Often PC and the 3D printer to print some headphone mounts. There's the time lapse in the top left corner. And this is the back of it, the unit where I'm attaching the uh, hook and loop Velcro. And then in the front, I'm going to go ahead and attach that uh, that holder for the remote control. And I'm really liking these uh, headphone mount that I made. It came out pretty cool. And I'll just go ahead and attach those right to the, uh, to the side of the, uh, the front of this. All 
everybody, thanks for joining me on this little uh, sofa hack, and uh, thanks for watching. This is Chris Demetric from TDW Woodworks, and uh, see you on the flip side.